just zoomed in and this is a proper day in the life. Today, uh, first stop, we're at uh, Teddy Cumber's Clydesdale Yard. Um, it's a big showing yard. I've been lucky enough to do Teddy's work for over 20 years. Um, as you can see, he's been pretty successful. Um, I think it's just a, a good all round horseman, and the horses are good to work on. Um, called in here to do some hunters. I've done these for over 15 years, so um, we're just getting going with the trail hunting now. So they've had the second set of shoes on, uh, so they'll be pretty thin. They're ready for doing big horses, but good to do. So just routine chewing. So I bought this hammer when I was 16 year old, I'm now 40. The shaft's worn to the shape of my hand, how I use it. I've actually just put a bit of tape on because I'm worried it's gonna finally retire. Uh, just before the international, the head fell off it. So I had to re-weld that back on. It's very difficult with tools because you get used to what you use and uh, you know my arms and elbows are really good. But when I tried to swap away from this because of how it's worn, it was hard to swap. But So we're just heading to Vanessa Roberts now to do two horses. It's, a, it's really quite common of um, in England is the, the horses are eventers, general riding horses during the summer and during the winter they turn to uh, hunting, uh, a bit of team chasing, so the multi-purpose all year round horses. So we're just nipping up the road now to um, a real nice lady called Lisa Hughes. She's a couple of Shetlands, a couple of donkeys, a couple of goats. Uh, we're not doing the goats, uh, I have before, but we're just doing the Shetlands and the donkeys today. Now we're going to Team Hailers, which is an international dressage yard. Um, it's a family run business by Paul and Bobby Hailer, um, and Bobby's fiance Andrew uh, works on the yard as well. Um, it's a really good yard, um, very professional, nice people, nice to shoot for, um, very nice horses, all different levels from youngsters they're bringing on to Grand Prix horses. Um, the horse we're off to do now is off to compete in the European Championships of the Spanish horses next week, so that's uh, nice to do. So now we're at Fife Racing Limited, trained by a great family, Marjorie. Tom and Amy Fife, mainly flat horses. Um, the thing about race horses is that you know I like it. It's something different during the day. I really enjoy playing. I enjoy following them. The thing about race horses is some you can shoot outside, like I've just done, and uh, some you've got to do inside. Um, you just got to keep the horse where it's comfortable and happy.
So now we've just uh, turned up at a, li a little livery yard of um, Sophie Barker's. Real nice yard, there's just uh, three horses to do here. So now we're finally going to the last yard of the day and this is just a, a typical Yorkshire livery yard um, where there's general purpose riding horses, competition horses, pony club ponies and we've got a mixture of all of them to do. Um, hopefully the weather's going to stay off because uh, you know, with these sort of yards they don't have the, the glamorous cover but uh, we'll see what we get. on the way home to the forge now um, now when we get back we always make the shoes sort the shoes out for the next day so I need to make some shire shoes so I'm going to start with them and uh, one of the apprentices James is going to strike for me and Jake's going to make some hunters for tomorrow as well so we'll get them made and 